Chris, it's good to hear you so happy. Hi, it's good to hear you so happy when you got out of the car today. Just tell me what that P2 means to you. Uh, yeah, honestly, I was good. Um, I just wasn't expecting that today. Um, and it's just always a great feeling when you're putting one foot in front of the other and just progressing. Uh, qualifying, you know, the weekend had been really difficult compared to the last race where we just kind of hit the road, hit the ground running. This weekend was really, really digging deep to try and get the setup uh, right. And I think we did a great job. And then qualifying was a little bit tricky. Obviously, to be far behind the Ferraris, we, we need to finish ahead of them to get the, uh, to keep the constructors. So I, that's what I was pushing for today. So to progress so so well through throughout the early phase of the race and then be challenging for um, uh, a podium and then a second place was it's amazing and I'm, I am really happy with the race. What can you take from this to go forward into these final three races as you say fighting for that second position in the cup constructors oh, but also good. for next <laughs> really I know you're is. trying to sell it. No I really not it's just it, it's really good. <laughs> um, Have you tried send it? me some and let, I'll let you know. Okay, okay. Um, so pushing for that second in the constructors seeing what the team have achieved this year how much confidence can it give you for 2024 from where you were at the start of the season you're now finishing races second challenging potentially for the win and you know the positives to take from the development this team's gone through this season i mean i am incredibly proud of my team you know I, and, I, and as i said at the end of the race like i have a total faith uh, in in the team i know we can build a great car we haven't for the past two years but we can build a great car i think you know, there's a lot of engineers that no one wants to copy anybody. They want to find their own way. Um, but I think we we they are we are progressing. But I've heard that Red Bull are progressing as well. So we have to be really, really strategic and really clinical with uh, moves. They know that already. But um, in order for us to be battling those guys, they're so quick on the straight. We're losing two and a half tenths into turn one. And um, but I believe if we can get, you know, I'm ready. So when we get, if we can get the car that can match them, we're going to have some great battles next year. So. George, I saw Toto come in and just give you, you know, a bit of moral support as well, because that was so tough hanging on there at the end. Oh, it must it have was. felt awful in the car. Yeah, it was, the last 20 laps was just, just terrible. Um, the pace was really strong after the red flag. I felt really good in the car. I was right behind Carlos, just couldn't quite make the overtake. And then my brakes overheated, was concerned we weren't going to make it to the end, so I had to back off. And as soon as I did that, I lost all the temperature in my tyres. I could never recover it, and it was like driving on ice, and I was lucky to finish in P6. So, story of the weekend, uh, another difficult one. It's a shame because the car was definitely performing well. Um, yeah, not, not a lot more to say. I mean, the positives, we go to Brazil next. It was pretty good for you last year. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So yeah. what sort of car have you got for next weekend? Um, sorry, what was that? What sort like? of car have you got for next weekend? Yeah, I think it'll be much... Um, I haven't seen the weather. I think it's a bit up and down, but it should be a much uh, more consistent weekend than we saw here in, in Mexico. Obviously, yesterday in qualifying, there was a lot of surprises um, for good and for bad for, for everybody on the grid. I think Brazil will be a little bit more uh, conventional. Um, of course, hoping to fight for a podium, if not more. Just um, on that back of second in the Constructors' Championship right now, every little bit counts in this battle with Ferrari. Are you confident you guys can take it? Yeah, I am, to be honest. I think we, we should have definitely had it sewn up already by now. Um, I think Brazil will, will have some good pace. I think the last two races will probably suit Ferrari a little bit more than, than us. Um, but we just need to have some clean weekends. And um, yeah, as you say, just keep being consistent, but I'm confident we'll, we'll achieve it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.